From the Weather NorCal Command Center, this is your morning update. Your weekend weather update is made possible by Caltrans District 2. Hey folks, good morning. Hope you had a nice weekend so far. Those well below average temperatures have been nice, but hey, I think the trend is upward starting today and heading into the next several days. Take a look at the valley, for example. No more 70s, right? We're going to be in the upper 80s here for today. Much drier, much clearer, clear skies taking back over. Nice crisp atmosphere out there. Siskiyou Modoc County, we're going to be there in the upper 70s. Eastern Mountains, probably 76, 77, 78 as well as we head through this afternoon and into this evening. But by the way, check it out. Here's what I was talking about. Whole lot of nothing going on here today. Those showers, those clouds have really moved out of here. They pushed off to the east as that low pressure system kind of faded away over the last several hours. And really, I think today looks fantastic, to be quite honest with you here. We're kind of in the intermediary period between the really cool temperatures and the really hot temperatures. So still not doing too shabby by any stretch of the imagination. Marine layers not really that active either, to be quite honest with you, as far as I'm concerned, compared to what we've seen over the last couple of weeks. So pretty much all of us will have a pretty nice trend for today and into the first half of the week. But by the time we're heading through midweek, listen, we're going to stay like this, right? We're going to stay dry and clear. And as a result, that high pressure builds up. We get hotter temperatures coming back in. So I kind of used this term yesterday, bipolar weather is what we're seeing. And you can kind of see that trend starting today. Notice the valley. We're already seeing those upper 80s, even near 90 taken back over. Trinity County, we'll call about mid 80s or so. Widespread 70s in Siskiyou County, Modoc County, the Eastern Mountains. But as we hit over the next several days, we're going to be above average in terms of those temperatures as compared to below average just over the last several. So yeah, we're just kind of going all over the pace, all over the place, right? Bouncing back and forth between these extremes as that low pressure has moved out of here. Taking a look at the regional here for the Pacific Northwest, you can see what I'm talking about as we head into the last week of August and the first portion of September. Well, check it out. All the way from Washington, all the way to the North State, really down to the Sacramento Valley, San Francisco, we see that widespread well above average swath of temperatures creeping back in here over the next seven, 10 days. And we can really see that here on the seven day outlook, taking a look a little further inland to Weaverville, especially you can kind of see what I was talking about Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, as we get back to the upper nineties. You can also see what I'm talking about here for today. That's sort of that intermediary period where we're not necessarily way below average, but we're not seeing these upper nineties just yet. So today's going to be a pretty nice day to wrap our weekend up. But as we head through the next several, yeah, Mount Shasta City, Modoc County, out towards the Eastern mountains, you see those widespread upper eighties take back over for the rest of the week. Susanville out here as well. Same story. We get back to the lower to mid 90s there. Let's head out to the valley. Redding's a good example because you're up there north. You have the highest shot at those really high temperatures and you can see those 90s creeping back in. And in fact, as we head through Wednesday, Thursday, maybe even starting Tuesday, give it one to two degrees of wiggle room. I could easily imagine a world in which we might see one or two of us hit 100 there. So the trend is definitely flipped on its head from what we've seen over the last several weeks, really for the last week or so, to be honest with you. So yeah, if you didn't enjoy the cool for some whatever reason, don't worry, we'll be back to this hot weather in no time. Thanks for joining me for this forecast update, folks. I'll be back with you at midday for more fresh from the Weather NorCal Command Center, and I'll speak to you then.